Last night, Bree Smith showed us that we're likely looking at a warmer than normal winter here in the mid state, which begs the question, what does that mean for our severe weather risk? If you had a hunch that a warmer winter might mean a more wicked winter, you were right. When La Nina conditions are in place, it tends to increase our risk for both severe thunderstorms and tornadoes. In fact, 50% of the deadliest tornado outbreaks in Middle Tennessee happened during La Nina years. Now, the March 3rd tornado that damaged so much of our area, including Mount Juliet Christian Academy, wasn't actually during a La Nina year. It was a neutral year. But by April, we were in La Nina conditions, so we were trending towards it when March 3rd happened. So while it's sunny now, we all know it is just a matter of time before the weather turns wicked and there are painful reminders all around of just how devastating our storms can be. So now's the time to make sure that you are ready when the weather turns wicked. There are two things that you can do to stay safe. Number one, make sure you've got multiple ways to get weather information. And number two, know where you'll go if you need to shelter and a warning is issued and not just at home, but at school, at work, all the places that you do life. For tips to help you identify those locations, I've got those in our story on newschannel5.com. For now, from Mount Juliet Christian Academy, I'm Storm 5 meteorologist, Bree Smith. Such good information. And as Bree said, having a way to get information is a critical first step in staying safe during severe weather. If you don't already have it, make sure you download our free Storm Shield app. It'll help keep you safe and informed during severe weather.